Hello, welcome. This is Can of Wormholes, a puzzle game that's come highly recommended to me. I've seen a little bit of video footage for this, but I feel like I didn't even get a great idea of what kind of uh, activity I'll be doing in it, so I'll be uh, excited to discover. I took a quick look at options in here. Graphics look like that. Audio looks like this. Eyebrow raised a little bit at this setting. There's an aim assist, and it's on by default, so I'll leave it and see what that means. A little 54 down in the lower left corner. I assume that's a version number, probably. Start! Save number one. Got three save slots, okay. RGB. BGR, rather. Whoa! <laughs> Alright, this is fun. The front snake worm thing gets to eat all the dots. Gonna run into a tennis ball though, watch out. Oh, I see, I'm seeing the view of... Ah! <laughs> okay, so that's a radar showing me what the snake that I'm inside is doing. I'm calling it a snake, it's probably a worm. Maybe. We'll find out. Alright, my worm crashed. What does that mean? <laughs> Who am I? Huh? It's pretty dark. Am I supposed to do something? No, I can wiggle a stick and that pops up. I don't want to skip. Thank you for going away. All right, there's some text there and possibly a cipher. I recognize the O. Presumably it says can of wormholes. It's the right, like, spacing and number of letters. Right O positions. Okay. I don't know who I am yet. I am the can of wormholes. Okay, so that's who I play as. Whoa, I can, uh, I can throw rings. I can only go up and down. Left and right aren't doing anything right now. Let's break out of here, I guess. There we go. Okay, so I got a bright light attached to my edge. Ah, launch wormhole. I see how it is. Dink. Oh, I made a thing curious. Okay, it rotated me and now I can go this way. This is wild. Like, this entire thing is... And experience. I can launch out that way. I nudged something into a slot. A curious worm is going over there. Alright. If I hit this hard enough, can I knock it over? I don't think so. Doesn't seem like it. Uh, plants are growing, maybe. Is there a limit to this, I wonder? All right, old ones do seem to disappear after a time. Can I just hold? No, I have to tap. All right, well, I'm rotated this way, so I can't explore that other glass case. Let's go here. All right, that little curious worm is there. I'm just gonna run over it, but it doesn't seem to mind too much. Oh, it's rotated me, thanks. Launch wormhole. Ah, maybe I wanna land it there, I did it. Okay, many mysterious things are happening. Okay, I think I'm in a puzzle now. Here we go, okay. Ooh, I'm assuming I want to shape myself to get in there. It seemed happy with that. Oh, except the thing I put in there died. Quite violently. And its juice is sprayed out into the rocket. Okay, worm juice is rocket fuel now? Gotcha. Hey, there's some light now. And I got rotated again. Alright, I guess I'm gonna get rocketed. Oh! Oh! Oh, that worm knows it at once. We're going on a journey. Not enough fuel, though. One worm won't do it. Gotta squish some more. That was more like a centipede. Oh no, the worm that was in there was too heavy. <laughs> Only the can can go. Oh, sorry, curious little worm. Guess I'm going without you. <laughs> Whoa. 
Going from unknown to unknown, indeed. That thing's getting burned up, but again, it doesn't seem to mind. Hungry baby bird. Gotcha. Oh, everybody's curious about me, and now they've turned into legs. All right. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, so I get omnidirectional movement. That's nice. Uh, okay, so, um, do I have analog movement? I do. Uh, okay, so same sort of facility, just on a different planet or something. I probably didn't actually change planets. I'm probably somewhere else in the same one. So I toss that upward now. It goes a little bit forward. Can I land that here? I can. There's strong magnetism. Okay, um... So what's this little popsicle stick fence? Oh, I can go outside the thing. Ah! Oh, I see how it is. Were there any control options? Oh, gain insight. Right. That's what this game calls hints. That's one of the few things I know about it. Okay, so move, undo, restart, show grid. I didn't see control options. And I still don't, so I guess I'm stuck with these, which is fine. It's maybe not, like, exactly how I would want it. Okay, so... This is like a... Almost a 3D snakebird sort of thing going on. So my body... Is subject to gravity, but any segment can hold any other segment up. Okay. Uh, puzzle count is one now, I guess. Cool. Alright, so if I fling a hole here... Ah, that's my targeting thing. Okay, I see. I didn't catch on to what that was before. This is pretty neat. Alright, fill that hole. Um, can I back up somehow? Yes. What are the rules of backing up? Well, perhaps if I flex my butt that way, then it'll go this way. And that's close to what I need. Okay. Well, that's intuitive enough. So I'm going to go here, flex my butt this way, flex it that way, and then I'm in the hole. Cool. And I get a little not quite pound sign. Great. Uh -huh. Man, like, there's a lot of stuff going on, and it's all very mysterious. So, like, I'm playing as a can whose legs are all individual worms that are curious and just, like, are supporting it. I launch out a little rubber ring, which I guess is a wormhole. It unrolls toward this puzzle, then something enters the brain of this centipede, then I take control over it. And we have a game. Okay. Uh, so that won't do, but I think I have kind of the right idea. That will eventually make the right shape. Not quite. Uh, that's not what I want. So I need to be able to back into... Okay. Um, having a little bit of trouble seeing how this will happen and I can't support myself that way. Okay, so restart is there. So yeah, learning a new way to think here. Just kind of going to mess around and get an idea of like what the parameters of this are. Obviously, I can't go around that way. It's actually kind of close, but not close enough. Now, could I... Let's see, I had an idea for a moment. Could I back myself like all the way down there? There we go, that's the way. Yes, okay. This is a pattern of movement I have not experienced before. Quite unique feeling. <laughs> and all it is is just like being long and being able to back up. Backing up with a long tail. Okay, I'm in a little fenced area and I'm gonna have to discover a way to get out of here. Okay, it's open on that side. So probably I just wanna do, well, that's a start, but then, yeah, then I'm stuck. So somehow I need to make 
a shape that will result in... This gets me stuck. Well, not technically. I can just back right out of it. So I need to make a shape that will transfer my tail from one side to the other. This will do it. Okay, yeah, so basically I can just straighten my tail. Yeah, cool, but now what? I guess I wanted... Instead of that, I wanted... Oh, uh... This is hard to think about, but hang on. So I did this. There wasn't enough room. And yeah, I still can't really make anything happen here. Okay, so how many am I? I, I don't have a, I don't have a mouse cursor. Do I now? No. Uh, okay, well, there's a grid. So I am one, two, three, four, five, six, seven long. One, two, yeah, okay, I can see the grid just fine here. So yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So measuring from where my head is. So there's not enough room to put my tail into that spot down there. Well, hang on, don't I just want to put it down the... Oh, this hole. Yes, okay, there we go. Uh, and now the rest of the puzzle, which is quite straightforward. Great. Let's put my tail in the wrong hole. All right, and I need three thingies. I have at least three. Great. Pop, pop, pop. This is pretty cool. Wow. And there's like this, this vibe, this, all this stuff going on here in the overworld that's separate from the puzzle activities. Is this food? Yes. Makes me longer. All right. So I found some fruits. Problem is, I probably don't want to be too long. I need to eat just the right amount. Let's guess for now the right amount is one. Oops. It's not. Okay, so I do need to fill exactly. I need to have eaten one, two, three, four, five more. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Cool. And I get some more juice. Ah, this tricky little thing. I gotta launch my thing, but I can't go there myself. That's fine. There's space between the trees. Okay, one, two, three. Uh, that's eight. And I am two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eat all the food. Okay, get longer before eating that one there. Got it. But I think there's a maximum length. I'm going to get this now because it feels like I'll have trouble later. I'm going to guess I need to be exactly the right length to reach this. I'm also going to guess I can't eat with my butt. Uh, I can test that. All right, <laughs> had a try. Okay, and that should be just enough space for me to get out of here. Then, um, wait, uh, then I'm gonna have a problem. Hold on, so it looked like, oh, I have two problems. It looked almost like I could push the food around. Um, I'm just, like, not making this happen. There we go. Oh, well, I'm not going to make that happen either. Uh, okay, so I can't test yet whether I can push the food. There was a previous puzzle where I could. See, if I go out here, this is how long I want to be. But if I go out here... No, hang on! This will work fine. Because I can occupy the space formerly occupied by my tail. So that is different from snakebird rules. Got it. Okay. Learning things. Can I go any faster? I can toss that. I can... Whoa! Okay. I can... So the right face button flings my can. That's good to know. Hmm. I can stick my legs up on this little thing here. That's fun. All right. Fling. So 
So I do need to grow by three, and there are three bits of food here. Can I push the food? Yes. Does that mean anything? Maybe. Uh, so if I am that long, then yes, I can. Oh, why did you straighten? Ah, because you move first, then eat, then grow. So therefore, I don't want to push that food. Okay. But I do want to push this food because I needed to eat this. But then that'll force me to push this food. So I push. Okay. So I push first. I turn around. I eat the one I pushed. No. That still doesn't let me escape. Because the problem with this is nothing. I'm not too long there at all. Okay, got it. Puzzle was something different from what I thought it was. All right. So I'm try. Hua! <laughs> I don't know why I want to knock over a plant pot so much, but for some reason I kind of do. <laughs> I'm going to launch myself at something and have like an effect happen is really the story. All right, so I do need to eat once only. Okay, I will have to eat this. I don't get a choice about that. I say no to that food. I'm all full, but I gotta get myself around that corner somehow. Well, can I take the water route? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think this all works. All I gotta do is mm, something I can't. And I can't do it from here either, can I? Okay, so if I tried to go in here, I could at this length. I could at a shorter length. However, then I die. Okay, so what if I came down here and ate this food? Well, sure, I ate that food. I'm the right length, but then what else do I expect to happen? So if I put my tail in here, then the rest of me doesn't slither to the right shape. If I put my long tail in uh, here somehow, I can't put it far enough. If I had food I could eat out here, after I've already put my tail there where it is, I could do better. There's no way I'm getting food out there. Can I shorten myself somehow? See, I've eaten too much already. The only current way I know to get food out of the way is to push it backward. I don't think I can get backward through here. If I were one longer, I could. Maybe that's meaningful. Can I multi-push? I think I can discover that here. All right, so if I'm one longer, uh, other way around, uh, uh, this way, I can multi-push. There was some reason that arrangement was going to be good. What reason was that? Because I can just crawl in here manually and be in the right shape. There we go. Okay. Wow. These simple little arrangements have quite a lot to them. This is nice. Oh, man. Kind of excited to see where this game goes as we continue. It's off to a very good start. Wah. Oh, that one over there didn't have a, uh, a port for me to fling a- Oh, it's part of the same puzzle, I see. Alright, so if I just grow and try to go, then I will be the wrong length. Can food be splooshed in the water and become a bridge? No. Yes. Yes. Okay, I didn't see it because my, my butt was over it. Okay, cool. So that sounds like what I want to do then. Let's push you this way. And I know I can multi-push, so, uh-uh. 
And I do want to eat once. And there we go. Neat. I guess I was expecting it to, like, expand in the water or something and be more visible. But it was just obscured by my body. That's fine. Okay, so here I'm going to have to do... If I were to do this action... Yeah, I fling across. I guess that's when I have to discover that. I just did it early. Uh, uh, oh, I was pressing the wrong button. <laughs> Fair enough. I noted that that thing I jumped over did appear to be a puzzle grid. Like, it had the same white grid pattern as the thing that the centipede's on now. Okay, I need to grow twice. There are three different ports here. Hold on. Um, how do I exit the puzzle? Like this. Like, there's another port here and one here, but only one of them has a uh, wormhole receptor attached to it. That feels like it must mean something. But I don't know what yet. Okay, I want to grow twice. And if I had grown twice, would I be long enough to just get over there or do I need to push foot? I need to push foot, okay. So presumably, hang on, so can I, I can't get over here. I only needed one food, so I think I eat one of the, uh, I thought I was pressing a different direction, but you went right instead of down. If I eat one of those, eat this one, uh, somehow get myself back. Oops, um, can I undo a restart? I can. Yeah, I see that. That's no good. Anyway, it feels to me like... Oh, hang on. So this is a trap. Once I'm in here, I can't back up. Okay. Wait, hold on. I want to grow twice. I want to push two things out, so... Uh, wait, no. No, I want to grow twice. Um, okay, get yourself into the right orientation. Uh, despite these being a little off, that should still give me the bridging capability I need. Ah, uh, but the issue is I can't eat these going forward. Yes, I can. Whoa, I... Oh, I had no room to grow there, so therefore I pushed. Oh, the way it slows it down. Okay, so I need room to grow. Got it. So without room to grow, I hold it in my mouth, then I do that. Okay. <laughs> Orient yourself, please, centipede. Just, just there. Uh, <clears throat> so I need to eat more, but I need to do some other things too. So if I'd push these, I wouldn't uh, be long enough and also wouldn't make it. So I have two problems. If I could have eaten one and pushed the other... Ooh, I'm uh, dead if I do that. Got it. Pushing you here is nice, sure, but I have no means to push you from there. I don't think I have a way to put this in my mouth without eating it. Or do I? I do? Okay. This camera feels awfully zoomed out. This one's better, but then it's overhead, and I, I like this angle. It's fine. I'll deal with the zoomed out camera. So... I've learned a mechanic. I don't yet know how I will use that. Okay, so anyway, there's... One, two, three, four, five spaces of water in my way. I need to be length five, the shortest path that gets me there. Yeah, it has five spaces of water in the way. Uh, where am I? So, 
ideally I want one food in the water here, two in my stomach, and then the other one doesn't do anything. Perhaps it gets dropped in the water here. It's a real nice slow down and zoom effect to really show me what's happening there because I would have been confused otherwise. But yeah, emphasizing it, it was very clear. That's quite well done. So, I don't think I'm traversing this in this direction. If I could land in a state where there was food here and here, the puzzle would be solved. Can I do that? Maybe I can. Okay, sure. So let's say I do this this way first. I am length four. No, I don't need insight. I'm good. Uh, so the question I had was, can I get my tail to a good place to push that? Oh, why would I want to do that? And also no. So I do still need to eat another of these. Hold on, one went in the drink. Oh yeah, I can see it there. It's just the perspective made it hard to see. Okay. So... Um, and again, I have the option to not have room to grow here if I'm one longer already. I don't think that helps me though. So I push forward by having food in my mouth. There's no way I'm pushing a food backward from here to there. Like the, the arrangement forbids that. I can't have the tail angle for that. If I want to do it forward, ah, I see. Okay, got it. I think I figured it out. So I want to, mm, 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 that's what I expect the restart button to be. That's why I keep pressing it. So I'm gonna do this, this. I'm long enough to get in here. I'll eat this food and mm, that's no good. I'm gonna be too long now. I ate too much. Otherwise, that works. Okay, so do that, but just don't eat the first snack. Instead, push it in the water. Got it. Okay. All right, this is a cool multi-step puzzle. Let's do that first, because I think I can. Yes, this should work fine. So you go in the water there so I can bridge across. You go over here, as you were. You go here then I can make it. Eat this normally. Put this in my mouth for later eating. Push that with that in my mouth. And there we go. Okay, cool. Oh, also... So, I make one rightward input and my head moves forward twice. I can grow from the head as well as from the tail. Because normally when I eat, I grow from the tail. Got it. Okay. This is definitely going to be relevant. Oh, this is cool. Okay, I think I'll be satisfied with having gotten through this room. I want to look at this one more time, just in case, like... I don't think there's a thing to launch onto there to, uh... to activate it, but... Throw can... Oh, okay, so it would give me that prompt if I hadn't already figured it out. I gotcha. But I did already figure it out. Does this go? It does go! Oh! I found another way to... Okay! So that actually just takes me to a whole new area where my legs are magenta and white and there are mushrooms. Okay, so an elevator here, but also this continues. So just hold still and my legs form up. And this is on... Did I miss any other side exits, I wonder? Hwa! Let's check. Oh, there's a map. Okay. 
Um, not according to the map, but maybe it doesn't map until I've found one. That's probably the first one I saw. Uh, okay, so next thing I see that I haven't taken, I'll check the map to see what it tells me. Uh, to see if it shows, like, a way I could go there. Um, because <laughs> I just don't want to walk all the way back to the left for probably nothing. Yeah, no, I can see the broken edge on well and left and right, but I don't know what that means for up down. Anyway, cool. All right, so this is, uh... Y for tilt view. Right, that would be grid mode, but there's no grid here. Throw can, launch wormhole, move, tilt, view, show map. All right. Well, good. Okay, this is super cool. I'm looking forward to seeing more.